No, 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 no. Hey, hey, I'm sorry, you guys. Hey, sorry, there's been a misunderstanding. There, hey, these clothes are not free. Just taking inventory. Brooke Davis, have you lost your mind? It's my store, they're my clothes. I can do what I want with them. But what are you doing? We're having a sale. For one day and one day only, everything in the store is freaking free. Hey, no. Do you want to talk about it? Haley told me about your mom. No. As a matter of fact, I don't want to talk about it. There's nothing left to say, Peyton. My mom's a bitch. She's a horrible, selfish bitch. You happy now? Is that a good talk? Why are you yelling at me? I'm going to need my key back, too. What? My house key. I moved out, right? I can't have people coming and going like it's some kind of Rachel Gatina cracked in. OK, Brooke, I understand that you're upset, but is there something else that's going on? I just need to feel safe in my house, that's all. So I need your key. Fine. What do you want, Peyton? What is it that you are doing here? I came here to tell you that one of Lucas's basketball players was killed last night. Quentin Fields. And Luke's a mess. I just thought you wanted to know. five-year-old son who loved Quentin. Just as much as many of you do, so, um, if you want to talk about how you're feeling. What's the point? I mean, he's gone, right? Some idiot just shot him, and now he's gone forever. So what's the point? There is no point. You think you can fool me? Huh? You think you can spoil my plan to get Jamie back with your stupid, defective heart? Well, you can't. I have a new plan. I'm not gonna have to see Jamie after all. He's gonna come right to me. Why would he do that? Because poor Grandpa Dan is dying, and his last dying wish is to say goodbye to his sweet little grandson. And then what? In a few months, I'll be dead. And when they can't find Jamie, they'll start looking for you. And then you'll be the future that you don't want to be. Mm. I've decided I can live with that. By then, I'll have a six month head start with my son. When life gives you lemons, you can't be a sourpuss. It won't work. They won't bring Jamie to see me. In case you've forgotten, I'm a murderer. Remember. Besides, my grandson's afraid of me. Oh. Not according to this. Found this in your jacket. Looks like Jamie loved you almost as much as he loves me. <laughs> What's he gonna do? Drive himself out here? What are you gonna do about the person who brings him? Well, I sincerely hope it's Haley. But I'm not going to do anything. Dan Scott, however, is going to kill that person. Oh, I'm getting worried about Slam Ball. That's my fault. I underestimated the speed of this game. <laughs> These guys are great athletes. They're fast. Well, you're going to have to be faster because I don't know if I can handle another game like the last one. I will be. Because I know you're trusting me. I love you for that. She's on her way. She's just running a little late. Maybe there's another guy. Why did I sign that option again? That reminds me. I'll get to make a quick call. I'll be right back. Hey, 
nice shot. Mmm, nice everything. Wow, <laughs> you look hot. No, I don't. I was like a tornado at home. Um, where's this producer? I need to ply him with many questions. I need to make a call on a cell. Well, in that case, I'm gonna go check my handiwork. Oh, you look so hot. <laughs> I don't think detergent removes spray paint. I know there's nothing I can say other than I'm sorry. I do these stupid things sometimes. I really am sorry, but you were nice to me, but I'm just not worth it. And where do you think you're going? I don't know. I... You're grounded. You're not kicking me out? No. And I hope that someday you stop acting surprised when you hear that. Now go to your room. Actually, go to my room because the windows don't open. What did you say about the party? Sam, I am so pissed off right now. Go. I'm sorry, Jamie. I think it's kind of cool. Wow. You've gotten even more beautiful. What are you doing here, Julian? Haven't you heard I'm optioning your fiancé's book? Like hell you are. Actually, it's already done. I'm quite charming. <laughs> but you know that, baby. Hey. There you are. Hi. Well, I see you two have already met, huh? Yes, we have. And you know what, Lucas? Feels like I've known her for years. <laughs> I thought you were sober. Not anymore. doing here so early apologizing for yesterday I was having a rage against the man tortured artist moment oh god kill me I'm the man now no you're the one who took a chance on me and guided my career and if you think I should record the songs from the label I will Mia I never want you to think I don't believe in your music I mean you're my first artist it's like being my first kid. And so, no matter what, I love you. And I'm gonna support you. But you gotta tell me what's really going on. It's not like I'm not writing. It's like I can't. The first record... Oh, honey, your first record, that was a lifetime of work. But you can do this. You have so many songs in you. I could see that a year ago. And I still see it now. So, here's the plan. I'm going to buy some time with our label partners, and you are going to go write some kick-ass songs, okay? That is, if you ever want to get on that ranky tour bus again. <laughs> I will. I promise. Your mama totally rocked that. Peyton. Hey, Brooke, what are you... Sam's gone. Practice, Scott. Bobby, what are you doing here? I thought Dave Shea was a GM. He is. I'm your new coach. What? Yeah, the truth is, my heart was never really into being a GM. I guess I just needed someone to remind me never to give up on a dream, you know? Yeah. I had a friend who did the same for me. 
So does this, uh, is this your comeback? <laughs> well, not yet. I don't even know that I'm a good enough coach to turn you into a point guard. <laughs> we'll give it a shot. Welcome back. <sighs> you too. My dad's a Charleston chief. He's at camp now, and he's going to play point guard. Sorry. I bet basketball makes you think about Q, huh? Yeah. I miss him. I wish I could go to his grave and talk to him. But Mom won't go. It makes it too sad. Sometimes I go with my mama. Maybe you can go with us next time. I wish I could go today. Maybe I can show you the way. Millie, can we talk? Actually, I'm kind of busy right now, pencil sharpening. Brooke's sort of a slave driver when it comes to pencil points. Talk to Mills. Look, everything can be taken back. Can it? Yes. And by the way you're both hurting, it's obvious that you still love each other. Besides, it's not fair to take it out on some poor defenseless pencil. Just talk to him out. 